This is the story how I created and scored a new mechanic in Rocket League. Rocket League was made in 2015, but there's tons of mechanics made every single year, even now up to 2022. 9 out of 10 Rocket League mechanics that are new are completely useless and will never use again. So in this video I'm going to try and do a mechanic that will be used again and look super clean. Introducing the turtle pop. This mechanic is basically a Muri pop but reversed around and doing it the other way around. This story starts back in 2018 when Muri found the Muri pop. This was a revolutionary mechanic that changed the game forever. You could get a reset without jumping and on the floor. This mechanic worked by barely touching the front of your car and the ball. This made the front of your car lift up a tiny bit and from this it gains a flip reset that you can keep for an unlimited amount of time. And if you boosted your car into the air, you could keep the flip reset and do whatever you want with it. You can score this in game and in private matches. On the 20th of May of 2020, Cobra.rl found out this pop mechanic. This mechanic was able to get you off your turtle whilst you're on the floor without using a flip. This was done by boosting into the floor really quickly. This made the front of your car pop upwards and made you being able to fly in the air. My mechanic was inspired by this. Of the 1st of September of 2021, an idea came to me. What if you could do the Cobra Pop and the Muri Pop on the same shot? This turned into the Turtle Pop. With many people saying this shot wasn't possible, I decided to take it into a training pack put the ball on max speeds going downwards and see if my car would lift up at all. With many attempts trying to get the perfect position on the ball, I finally got this shot. This shot finally showed it was possible to actually do this shot but only in custom training. I'd never tried this shot outside of it and it seemed impossible at the time. The story for this mechanic carries on a couple months later, in late January, when I finally got this shot in free play. This shot showed it was fully possible without having any costume training or mutators. This changed this shot forever. But there is one downfall of this mechanic, and that is that you don't get a reset where you do in the Muri pot. So this is where I went back to the drawing board to try and find a good method of getting a reset before. 13th of March of the 2022, this is when I finally had a few ideas of how to get the reset, and this is the main one I got. I had a lot more ideas, for example, getting a ground reset, Fetalix jump, or one of the helix jumps is as well. But this one seems most accessible and looks the best as well. This made it possible to get the flip reset for unlimited amount of time and making it as good as the Muri pop in a private match. And also in my opinion easier than the Muri pop and looking a lot cleaner. But every good mechanic has to be able to be hit in games in limited boost. So my next goal was to find a method to hit this in limited boost. Skipping forwards towards the 21st of March 2022, I finally got this shot in limited boost. Doing this shot the same way as the Muri pop would be impossible to do this in game. 
But one thing that you have to do is hit the ball out as far as possible and maintain as much boost as possible. Another thing is that you need to pop your car up really smoothly and quickly as that bit is the part that wastes the most boost. Doing those three key elements perfectly still doesn't mean you'll get the shot because you still have very limited boost to actually get the final touch into the goal. This shot is possible with multiple touches but extremely difficult. In the future there might be ways to get multiple air dribbles or getting a flip reset off this but for the moment it's near impossible to get any more boost than possible. If you want to watch these clips in their organic form, go onto my shorts channel and watch them on there. There is nothing more to this video, so thank you for watching, like and subscribe, put the notification bells on, and go to my shorts channel to watch the original clips for this video. And I'll see you in the next video hopefully, and bye.